Hello everybody and welcome back to some more uh, vacation recap games. Um, I got four games here for uh, Red League, I believe. So um, yeah, let's just get right into them. First match up we got um, the Mortal and the uh, uh, whatever his team name is. <laughs> Let's see. I've got it written down somewhere. Philadelphia Pitchers. All right. So Mortal and the Philadelphia Pitchers. Um, yeah. So I don't have much to say about this match, but it. Let's just say that it it, it didn't go well for me. In the end, um, it was a quite a stally match. Um. With his Suicune, obviously. Nice Petal Blizzard there, doing some damage. That the Petal Blizzard doesn't show up in the Calcs, which is really weird. Um, and uh, a bit annoying to play with. Normally, Mortal Suicune is um, not too hard to deal with, because he brings the same set, like, 90% of the time. Um... And it was walled by my Politoed. Um, but he was just like playing real stally. And Petal Blizzard does not do enough. <laughs> Even though it's a physical move and then I get burnt, that's annoying. Some nice crits would have been good, but. Yeah, and then we go, we got the rest. I do have the strength set though. So I'm going to get healed a lot. Legitimately, um, Seismato just sits in front of this thing. Um, but the problem with that is I have to click moves. <clears throat> and it'll burn through my PP. Call the Scald there into the Water Absorb. Yeah, he switches the Ditto in on my Water Absorb as well. So I gotta really, I gotta be careful to play around that too. He gets a crit on my Vile Plume from a Sludge Wave. That sucks. Um, not too bad though, because I can just Strength Snap and get that all back. And then Hound Doom's annoying. Gotta see if he's got the. Uh, Solar Beam or anything like that. Um, in Power Grass. Something to watch out for. It would be nice if I got a Poison on the Suicune. Like, it doesn't really matter. It's got Rest anyway, but... I mean, here at least I can slow it down, I guess. Yeah, no Poison. Come on. Come on, Sludge Wave. That's the critical hit on my... Uh, I'll play him again. Got a nice strength snap there. Strength snap is such a broken move. Even against special attackers, it's getting me back like half health. Stealth rocks up, so punish all is switching, I guess. But uh, bandits is all right there, I believe. Gets me a quiver dance with the aurora veil up. Uh, it's gonna be annoying to deal with this weekend. He's 1 1, I'm 3 3, and it's a crit. <laughs> like, that was doing like 25% without a crit, and I would have been able to kill it back after the Aurora Vale wears off this turn. Um, yeah, so that sucked. Like, he wasn't killing me with that um, Scold without a crit. Like, definitely not. Plus one. Um, 
like, sure, he might have been able to revenge it with, like, the um, Zygarde or something after, or, like, the Ditto itself. But, um, yeah, there was no way that Suicune was beating that um, Volcarona at that point. Without that crit there. Because I Giga Drained it, get all my health back. Um, and then, even if Ditto comes in, I do more to Ditto than it does to me. And I think I still win the fight against the Ditto as well. Even if that Ditto does put me into range of the Extreme Speed from Zygarde. Or even the Bullet Punch from Scizor. Um, but yeah, so basically it just turns into a Suicune stall. He can't touch my Seismitoad, so he's just trying to PP stall me out. I predict the switch there, I guess. I didn't want to waste all my Scold. As you can tell, it's a very fun match. Ditto does eventually die. Or is it Houndoom that dies? Who knows? I do know that I lose 5 0. Um, I let Seismato get too low against the um, Houndoom there. Didn't get any effects spawn against the Scizor, which would have been nice. But yeah, Scizor cleans up. Um, yeah, very annoying game to play, to be honest, uh, but that's just how some of them go sometimes. Um, Volcarona just straight dying to a Suicune crit. Like, even if the Suicune wasn't one plus one there and it crit, it wouldn't have killed me. So, um, yeah, plus one crit uh, goes straight through my 3-3 three, three. Volcarona. You do. Next match, we've got... Uh, Zach, ZDH, and um, the Atlanta Braviary, Braviary, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so we'll get straight into this match. Uh, Rotom, I was expecting like a Diggersby lead or a Ferrothorn lead, something like that. Um, Yarn Mega is really annoying to deal with. Predicted the uh, the Giga Drain there, and uh, I should get. I risked the roll there, I guess. Uh, he didn't have a super good chance of two hit killing me, especially with Black Sludge, but. Valplum goes down, I get the para. Why couldn't I have got that against, like. This is all last game. <laughs> I uh, get my rocks up, which is nice, but then Sylveon's going to be quite annoying to deal with. Especially now that it's got a hyper voice up, uh, a calm mind up. I had to get it in range of, like, my Haxorus. Uh, I was originally the Fairy Resist Berry here, which would have been nice, but yeah. I would have been able to get a second hit from the Haxorus there rather than sacking it like that. I didn't prepare for this team uh, very well at all, to be honest. Um, but right, what can you do? Get a lucky para there. Guess his rapid spin off, okay. But get my Rocky helmet. I see high jump kick high jump kicks me. Nice gold again, doesn't kill. I jump kicks and gets a kill. Um, but at least he's down. Oh, Corona is just going to die to Victini here. V create sucks, but that's what you get. 
And yeah, that's just, that's game. There's nothing I can really do here. Um, inadequately uh, prepared for the um, Yarn Mega and um, a Carmine Sylveon. So that's it. Uh, <laughs> that was a nice quick one to get through. Um, no Supreme hacks there or anything like that that uh, really affected the uh, outcome of the game unlike the last one, but that's okay. Um, next up, we got Axel and the Minnesota Bear Ticks. Um, can't remember how this game went, to be honest. I probably lost. I've been losing a lot recently. Colberberry, uh, Rotom was exactly what I wanted to happen there. That played out perfectly for me. Um... But I don't think the rest of the game keeps going my way like that, so. I was expecting like an iron head there or something because of my uh, fancy. I gave this Skarmory a scarf so that he can't really get his health back and stuff as easily, but uh, still, it's a bit of a problem. Uh, Willow Wisp on the Pokemon 2 is not the best because it can just recover and stuff. Um, yeah, this was a tough game to prepare for, to be honest, but I should have just gone for an attack there, to be honest. He gets his defog off. Um, even though I magic bounce it away, it uh, still gets up, which is annoying, but. Um, going for a second Quiver Dance here was my best play. I had, uh, what did I have? I didn't have, I had Fly in EMZ, not Grass EMZ. Um, so I needed plus two to, uh, kill with Giga Drain, which would have got me most of my health back. Um. But he was Z Hydro Pump, which was like the only move that killed me at plus two, I believe. Maybe other Z moves did as well, I'm not sure. But I uh, at least had a chance of living a straight Hydro Pump. Um, and I'm pretty sure I lived a Z Scold at plus two. Uh, so unfortunately, I do go down. That was my that was the only way I was winning this match at that point, I believe. Uh, who lands a Hydro Pump, to be honest? He switches out. Um, Dragon Dancing there would have been a good play, but... Uh, I had Swords Dance, I guess. I was expecting Intimidate Crocodile. Um... But that is not something that, uh... He brought. He brought the Moxie version. And just Axe just dies to a Brave Bird there. Unfortunate. But what can you do? Um, this is just a... I'm going to lose eventually. <laughs> Chatot cannot save me. 29 to a Jirachi, that's not terrible. I didn't use chat art to its best effectiveness in uh, this season, so uh, unfortunate. Another 5-0 loss to me, so yeah, I don't think I'm making playoffs in red either. Um, <laughs> oh well. I don't think I'm making playoffs in a lot of places. I've been playing like trash. Um, can you do? And our last match versus Cade and the uh, Busy in this league. 
I don't know. I don't have that written down. Hollywood Hell Luchas, maybe. Uh, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? We'll run through this match quick. Um, <laughs> taunts me and can't get my parting shot off. He gets his own parting shot off and good players. Uh, not a bad uh, start for him. Take that icicle crash. Good old Rotom. I really do like base form Rotom, to be honest. Missed the Will-O-Wisp on the uh, Oil and Persian. That sucks. But uh, predict the taunt that time and get a nice Volt Switch off on the Oil and Persian. Gorgast, I should have just gone for uh, Chatter there, I guess. When Gorgast is around, it would make sense. He gets the nice prediction. And uh, Pursuit does nothing with the Colber Berry. It does nothing really without the Colber Berry either. But... And now we've got to try and deal with Mega Morwile. He gets a nice crit. That sucks, but what can you do? That time I do get a nice parting shot off. And even an Icicle Crash does not freaking kill there, which is annoying. But uh, I do just go for the Pursuit this time. Because I feel like that would have killed even if he didn't switch out, maybe. But getting rid of that was nice. And Weaver was kind of useless at that point, so. Goes into the Tapu Coco. I go into my Haxorus. Uh, scout for the Fairy move. There we see the Dazzling Gleam. Uh, should have gone for the multi attack there, I guess. But uh, he is low. Oh, he can't. He's got his damage reductions. Uh, Freaking Pilo Swine. I don't know if I bought a grass type move on uh, Haxorus for that match, which uh, was not smart. But I mean, not Haxorus on um, Ocarina. Yeah, no, I didn't. <laughs> uh, which would have been nice. Z, Grass CMZ would have been good. Axorus can, uh, they, uh, so Valley can go down once again. Uh, more while. Pulled a nice heat wave on the, uh, more while. But then he, uh, sucker punches me. That was a roll to kill. Unfortunate. Um, like, uh, he needed a high roll to be able to kill me. But what can you do? That's, it happens. Um, there's not much I can do against this Pylos one now. It, uh, yeah, it just wins at this point. Axorus, I can try and get a Dragon Dance off to win me the game, but uh, he's got the Ice Shard, so it doesn't matter. Ugh. What can you do? <laughs> Yeah, this league uh, hasn't been the, going the, well, uh, the best for me, so. Oh, well. Um, it's just, uh, like, I think it, it's mainly my own plays. Like, I don't feel like I've been building bad teams or been drafting absolutely terrible teams. I mean, they probably haven't been optimal. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I just uh, get into a game and uh, wheelchair completely. So, um Thanks for watching, guys, and I will catch you all later. Peace.